We're here with Search on the set of his new talk show. Thanks for having me. It's a pleasure. So this has been in the works for six years. We're finally here. Tell the audience what this show is going to be. What I'm hoping is that an hour every day, people can find something that they knew anyway, they just weren't thinking about it, and say, God, you know what, he's right. And hopefully make a turn for the better and make a, a positive change in their day that can hopefully transfer into their life. We all lose people. Everyone in this audience has lost somebody. But now that you're here with me, do you think that that loss causes you that anger? Yeah, sometimes. Let's mourn this loss together. You lost a daughter, you lost a sister, both of you. But that's no reason to allow the past to be your present. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're gonna lose people in your life, Felicia. Other people. And these two people, they don't wanna lose you. You are all about resolving the issue. You know, not just coming on here and having people yell at one another. It's at the end of the hour, at the end of the segment, Let's try to see what we can do to help these people and get resolution. It's called honesty. She not being honest. Okay. I respect that. That's some grown ass man education right there. Bobby, you're gonna you're gonna find a wonderful woman. Oh yeah. Because you're a good dude. You're I'm like an oak. You're like a solid oak. You have good foundation. You're honest, you're integral, you got great character. And I know you're gonna be fine. Oh, I'm gonna be good. Got the guard in my hand. I'm just waiting for the, another good woman. Okay. Pleasure. Thanks. Pleasure, my dude. You're not afraid to reveal about yourself. You're not the perfect guy. No. You said, I've had, I've had ups and downs in my marriage. I've had ups and downs in my life. I've had all kinds of things go on. My wife made a very good point to me. She said, if you're going to do this show, I want you to be 100% authentic. Don't pretend. Warts and all. It's a lot of talk shows on the air. How is search going to be different? What's the takeaway? I believe the takeaway is that I like to talk to people. I like to break bread with people. I'm, I'm genuinely concerned about the people that sit in these chairs. Um, it's not just they're a guest. They have a story. They have a life. And they're looking for help. They wouldn't put their faces on national television if they weren't in desperate need of help. How do I really know you still love me as your sister? Do you? do you? I mean, yeah. do you understand? But do you understand she's hurting? And I just want to talk to them. You know, I think a lot of people on TV maybe talk at people. I want to have a conversation. So why are you crying now? It's OK. Because I just learned so much from you that you can't tell somebody you love them and then put a butt behind it, you know? I mean, you're right, and I just learned just that one thing you've said to me. I've learned, you know, it, it, it made me open my eyes and realize you can't say, well, I love you, but you do this or you do that. You know, right. you can't do that. My experiences can only benefit others because if I lived it, I can show you how not to live it. Thanks, man. Best of luck. Thank you.